use the real-time chart view in eSquared Studio, launch a debug session, and click Resume or F8 as a shortcut until you get to Main. Then look for a global variable you wish to use in a chart display. We'll want to copy this for later use. To do this, we can highlight the variable and either right-click and copy or use the Control-C shortcut method. If the real-time chart is not displayed in any of the working windows, you can open it by selecting Window, Show Item, Real-Time Chart. If this is not in the main list, you can access it under the Other option, in which a new dialog box will pop up, and under Debug, you can select the real-time chart. Once open, or set as the window of focus, right-click and select New Series. In the Expression field, enter the variable name by either typing or pasting, Control-V, the variable that we copied earlier. Then, select the settings for the display and click Save. Once you resume code execution, you'll see the chart update in real-time as the variable changes. You can adjust most of the real-time chart settings by right-clicking on the real-time chart window. Here you can adjust settings like the access range, zoom in out, or change the refresh interval. By accessing the Properties submenu, you'll find many other settings to control the real-time chart view. You can also add more variables to the chart by adding another series or deleting a series from the chart. For more information on eSquared Studio, including documentation and downloads, go to renaissance.com slash e2studio.